What's good? This is JVB representing SPD and that is sportsperdm.com. Damn. Had to get some water in the system real quick, but I'm doing this video on Andy Dalton and as of right now, when I'm recording this video, Andy Dalton is the Chicago Bears' number one quarterback. He is the QB1 for the Chicago Bears. And yes, Ryan Pace and Matt Nagy, they're doing all they can to not have a quarterback controversy. But when you trade up nine spots from 20 to 11 to draft Justin Fields, arguably the second, if not the best quarterback coming out of this year's draft, there's going to be some controversy. But Andy Dalton, he has the right mindset. First of all, he knows who he is. He knows he's not a great or a good quarterback. He knows he's an average, above average, at best quarterback. So let's get that out the way. Andy Dalton knows who he is. Andy Dalton also knows that at this moment, he is the QB1 for the Chicago Bears that Ryan Pace and Matt Nagy brought him in to be the number one quarterback for this team. Or at least that's what they told him when they signed the man to a one-year, $10 million contract. Yes, I still can't believe that shit. But nevertheless, Andy Dalton is saying all the right things. He is the number one quarterback on this team right now. But if Justin Fields is ready to play in the NFL, if he's ready to start for the Chicago Bears... Guess what Justin Fields is going to do? Justin Fields is going to start at quarterback for the Chicago Bears. It don't matter what Andy Dalton does. Andy Dalton could be having a decent season. Now, if he's having a great season, if he's having a career season, obviously you're not going to move Andy Dalton away from the number one quarterback spot. But if Andy Dalton is at best decent, Andy Dalton is going to lose his job if Justin Fields is ready to play. Justin Fields already in OTAs has shown that he can play. But I love how Andy Dalton is approaching all this right now because he knows there's competition in Justin Fields. Once the Bears did what they did in the draft, he knew it was on. They can say all they want, Ryan Pace and Matt Nagy, about how Andy Dalton is the quarterback number one. We all know how the hell they feel. We Bears fans. We ain't that stupid. We know damn well why Matt Nagy and Ryan Pace, they made that move for Justin Fields. Because we all know that these guys don't have guaranteed jobs past this upcoming season. This could very well be both Ryan Pace's and Matt Nagy's last year with the Chicago Bears. So you can't tell me that they're going to keep Justin Fields in the holster while Andy Dalton is going out there and he's being Andy Dalton while you got Justin Fields, this hot young prospect, when you can throw him out there and you can have him play if he's ready in the NFL, they're going to do it. They're going to make that switch, and Andy Dalton knows that exactly. At the very least, he can be a very solid backup quarterback to Justin Fields if, if Justin Fields is NFL ready. If Justin Fields is ready to be the QB1 for the Chicago Bears. Andy Dalton, like I said, I love what you're doing, but all you're doing right now is you're keeping that seat warm until Justin Fields is ready to take the field and be the starting quarterback for the Chicago Bears. At the end of the day, the Bears drafted Justin Fields for a reason. These guys, Ryan Pace and Matt Nagy, traded up to get this guy for a reason. They only have one year left on their contract, and you got to be out your damn mind if you don't think that these guys aren't going to push Justin Fields to play whenever he's ready. Hopefully he's ready, because I don't want them to fuck him up. But if he's ready, they're very well going to move Justin Fields to the QB1 position over Andy Dalton. But I'm out. Like the video and share the video. And do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Until next time. Take it easy. God bless. Peace.